This is a free speech wall. Um, it's constructed out of plywood and uh, some wooden bases and covered in paper. Uh, we're just allowing students to come write messages on it for the rest of the university to see. We've actually seen some cool things. Not all of it is political, but we are seeing naturally political things. Um, there have been some cool quotes, inspirational things, um, some pick-me-up messages, which is always cool. Um, and we haven't seen much hate speech, but of course that is one of the things that um, is expected with free speech. Um, you have freedom of speech to protect hate speech um, because it's important to be able to speak your mind and express yourself. Um, and it lends itself to an environment that encourages a collaboration of ideas, especially in college campuses. You want to be able to speak your mind um, and freely think things of that nature. Um, so free speech kind of creates a good atmosphere for that. Okay. This is Young Americans for Liberty. Um, it's kind of an apolitical organization, um, but if anything, we're libertarians. Um, we are a university chapter of a national organization of Young Americans for Liberty. We actually don't consider ourselves a meeting type of organization. We are an activist organization primarily. Um, we don't want people to feel like they have to be a member or show up to regular meetings to be a part of something. Um, we have a Facebook group um, that's really easy. It's facebook.com slash BGSU Young Americans for Liberty. Um, they can go join that page and we'll have dates of different activism events. We also have an email and Twitter, just search for those. Um, but it's very easy to just find us and plug yourself in and you'll see us around campus. We'll be doing plenty of things. There is something for everyone here um, and a lot of the problem is apathy on campus. So if you are interested in politics, there are resources around here that you guys can check out.